Hi, Howard Berg, the world's fastest reader, with another tip. You often hear that grit and hard work pay off. Let me tell you a story about when I was younger. I was working as a part-time typist at a bank, and I worked really hard. I was working at blazing fast speed. On Thursday, the day before they had to decide whether they were going to keep me, the person who was my supervisor pulled me over and talked to me and they said, you know, you're working really, really fast and hard. The rest of us are going to be here after you leave and people are watching how fast you work and how much you're accomplishing. If you can't slow down and work at the same speed as the rest of us, we're going to have to let you go. And believe it or not, that actually happened to me twice. Once in a bank when I was working in college and once in a law firm where I was working as a word processor. And the same story. After you leave, we need to stay here. And you're working too hard. And you're getting too much done. And the people who stay here don't want to work that hard. And if people see you working as fast and as hard as you're working, they're going to want to know why we can't keep pace with you. So either you slow down to our level, or you need to leave. I think this is a really good reason why people who have grit and hard work and want it to pay off need to work for themselves. Then you know you're not going to have a boss who's going to yell at you when you work too hard. And here's the best part. When you work for yourself, you get to keep what you make, and you'll have the best boss you ever had. You want some more tips? I'm going to teach you how to read faster, absolutely free. Go to Howard. ReadingTips.com. That's HowardReadingTips.com. That's my tip for today. And by the way, it was a true story. Take care.